So I'm here with Drew Ferguson, head coach of the uh, Paris soccer team. We're here at the 2014 America Cup. Drew Canada just played Brazil in the semifinal. Fortunately, we lost 6-1. Um, just general thoughts about the game. Start there. Yeah, it, uh, the results doesn't, doesn't surprise me. Um, you know, we prepared our players uh, to play this game as a total learning experience versus really trying to get a result. I mean, as a coach, you always want to try to get a result. You know, so the idea was to try to defend as much as we could, and could we get lucky and they miss out? 20 chances and we win one nothing. Uh, the odds of that happening were getting pretty slim. So, um, you know, we, we knew that we were trying to work on defensive playing, playing defensively against these good teams. You know, we had a 16 year old, a 2 17 year old, 18 year old in the field playing against one of the best teams in the world. Um, if you did that in able body world, the score would be the same thing. So, we're not disappointed. The kids aren't disappointed. We are disappointed a, few, a little bit that we gave up some bad goals just by, you know, things that we talked about at training and then we still got caught on it. But saying that, it's a very, very quick team, very fast, and it's very easy to get beat one twos and ball watches. So, um, you know, to the, the person who doesn't know the game much, they, they might think six months a real thumping, but with what we had on the field, the learning experience, uh, moving forward to the World Championships next year and the Parapan Avs next year, it's, it's going to give us a full year of, of them learning those mistakes and working on them. As you said, so just a sure, but uh, so Canada next year has qualified for the World Championship in 2015. We also have the Parapan Avs. So just uh, maybe a bit more on, I guess, the importance for those young guys, because we did have an 18-year-old, several 17-year-olds. I mean, this was just pure learning experience, wasn't it? Well, absolutely. I mean, they're, I mean, Brazil's a fast team. I mean, even their fitness. You know, it's grown men against boys at times, and even the fitness level is going to be a bit different for that matter. So, uh, you know, we've got people like Liam Stanley, Sammy Sharon, who are, are very young, but they're getting, they're growing and they're getting bigger. So another year of growth and another year of playing, they're going to be stronger, even stronger players now than they will be next year. So. Um, are we going to beat Brazil next year? Probably not. But can we get in the top eight and go to be, go to uh, Rio de Janeiro? Possibly. So that, that's the bright future for us. And now they've also played Brazil, which I guess maybe takes away some of that edge of hey, now you've actually played one of the best teams. So Absolutely. It takes away some of that fear, hopefully, yeah. for the next time. Absolutely. They, you know, they we tried to build them up so not to be scared of them, and we tried to build them up. Don't worry about the score. Just go and have fun. But it's it's very hard to convince somebody to just go and have fun when they were scared they're going to get thumped. So uh, overall, it wasn't so bad. And I mean, the highlight of the whole thing was we scored a goal. And nobody scored a goal against Brazil in this tournament yet. So we're the only team in the tournament scored a goal. So that's a, that's a positive thing going forward. And next, um, we have one more match. We're going to be in the bronze medal match against the USA. Just a couple of thoughts for that game. That's coming up on Friday. Yeah, I think that'll be a good game. Uh, you know, and again, they've got a bit more experience than we do for sure. Um, you know, the last two or three times we've played, all the games have been very, very tight, I believe. So, uh, you know, that's a game I think we can go in and get a result. But it's also a game if we don't play well, we won't get a result. So um, I, I think if people come out and watch that game, they're really going to see a tight game. Uh, lots of action both sides and I think they'll really enjoy it.